When you've been to Helen back, it gives you something you didn't have before. It gives you the necessity to view the world in a different way, everything you are, through the lens of what happened to you. For a long time, I was filled with doubt and shame. I was ashamed of who I was when I was with him, and I was ashamed of what I had to do to survive. forcibly marking its tracks in the earth, a steady, unrelenting wearing away of the foundation of who you are until you feel like you're riddled with cracks and fissures and weaknesses. Even once you can learn to expel that doubt and shame, even when the river dries up, the deep rivets are still there. It's so much work to fill all those holes, but it is sort of a phenomenal thing. Because how often do we get to choose how we build ourselves up from nothing again? sweet knowledge that even though I lost so many possibilities and trajectories for my life, I also gained everything that I am now. To know that you've lost so much, but at the same time, you became a person you really love. To cherish who you are now, that's what being a survivor does to you.
you're patient and lucky and you find a thousand tiny ways to heal over a long, long time, you can become someone who is whole again. Someone who was riddled with cracks that were forced there by malice and terror, but was able to instead fill the holes and rebuild herself with love, empathy, 